Hey guys, it's Luxium here, and today I'll be showing you how to set up Essentials and Group Manager for your Minecraft bucket server. Uh, group Manager is basically just like an easier way f to use permissions. It's simpler and easier to use. So, first off, what you want to do is you want to download WinRAR for whichever software, whichever uh, uh, version suits your uh, your computer. Then what you also need is Notepad++ to be able to edit the YML files. And then here is the Essentials. You'll need to download Essentials Core and Group Manager. Just download those, open them up. And then go over here, open up Plugins folder, and then just paste them in there and then what you want to do start the server and I'll show you guys what it looks like that's pretty much it, it'll have that for any new that will show up for any uh, new person who comes onto the server and right now I'm just a default guest person use that shoe, yeah. Yellow's default. And then stop it. And now I'll show you how to set up group manager. Okay. Worlds, worlds. Here's groups and then here's users. Groups are like ranks and then these are the individual people and you can like change them to be a different rank. So say here's my username and then you want to make me a builder just like a builder because this is this is one of the ranks in here builder right here and most all the new users will come out as default because for this one default is set to true which means that any user will be this rank when they first join and you can change which rank they are in, in the users. And whenever a new person comes in, they'll need to uh, add in their name. Like, so say their name is like happiness123, and just copy all this stuff. And make sure on this, make sure you use tabs and not spaces, or else it'll get all screwed up. Permissions. Permissions you'll be doing in the groups of uh, uh, YML, uh, just making a build. And that's pretty much. That's what you'll mostly be doing. And then groups over here for builder. Say you wanted them to be able to use warps. So I'll have this link in the description. These are all the permissions, like commands. And where's warp? Warp, right here. To be able to use the slash warp command and be able to figure out the find out the list and stuff. So just put in space and then the whatever that is the dash and then just copy it right here. Essentials dot warp. And then also to be able to go to a warp essentials dot warp dot warp name. Okay. So save that and then here I'll make myself an admin and I'll create an actual warp because admins are uh, eight, have all commands so I'll start the server whenever you make a change just make sure to press this button right here the save button and then start the server so right now I'm an admin here I'll do set warp and I'll call it now I'll walk over here and I'll change my stop server and I'll change myself to a build. Save it. Start it up. And now, oh, sorry. Now I'm a builder. As you can see, that my name is now green. And you can change the colors for the different ranks. And now do slash warp Peter. 
and I go to the warp, warping to Peter, because I added in that permission for that certain command. And then do slash warp, and there's the different warps. But you see, try and, if you try to set a warp, like F, you do not have access to that command because I haven't let him let a builder just use that command. Get out of there. Drop the server. And that's all you pretty much do. So, say you want here. I'll do one more example. Say you want them to be able to set their home and be able to use slash home. Go in here to your groups. Enter essentials. Dot set home. Save it. Go over here. Here, start the server. Start it up. Slash set home. Home has been set, and then you can use slash home to get back to wherever that location was. Say I'll go, I'll go walk all the way over here. Slash home. And I'm back over to where I was. You can see in the council where they use the different uh, commands. And that's really all it is to it. Um, I'll show a uh, now I'll show you how to set up the different the config file for essentials. Oh yeah, and right here, this is where the different warps are set, and it'll have the location of them. Just a little thing. So config.yml. This is the basic. This has everything, all the different uh, settings, pretty much for it. It's pretty much like settings. So, you know, most of the time you don't really need to change any of this, all this stuff, you don't really need to change anything. Um, this is kits, this is like for like newbies or people just joining this, joining the server. They can uh, type, I think it's slash kit, and it'll give them these items. These are uh, wood, like axe, pickaxe and shovel, and the, there's like a time limit between they are able to do that. This is set at 10 minutes. Backups, 60 minute time, different, like when it actually does a backup. Um, yeah, most of the stuff you don't change. Respawn at home, this is, this you might actually change sometimes. Um, the economy, I usually use the economy plugin. I don't really use the essentials like economy. Essentials chat, I'll show you guys how to use that. It'll let you have like d prefixes, color prefixes for different uh, ranks. Essentials protect, I never really use this, I used world guard. Um, spawn, uh, yeah, no, don't really change that. PVP, if you want PVP on the server, like different damage to uh, the players. So maybe you want to take off fire damage. Um, weather, you can disable weather or enable it. And this will be what shows up for new people on the server. And yeah, here, I'll go into the other YML. Upgrades down your own, don't really need to change that. And this is for the economy, the worth.yml. If you're not using like a different plugin like economy or something, this will be where you change the prices for different items. This is where it, just how you control everything. I usually use economy. I've never used this before, but it's not very complicated. Just change the prices to whatever. And that's pretty much it. I hope you guys liked this video, and I'll be making more soon. Um, please, if you have a question, just leave a comment or inbox me, and I'll soon be making more videos on uh, the uh, Essentials chat and some other stuff soon and uh, and I'll be making an upcoming server soon and I'll have a little uh, trailer for that maybe I'm not sure I might I don't know whatever um, so yeah so I'll see you guys later bye